In this session, we are going to use Python to work out uh, a few different options for us. So the first one is going to be area of a circle, the next one is going to be circumference of a circle, and the last one then is going to be diameter of a circle. Now we've got the calculations here, right, or the equations here for us, so we don't need to remember them too much. Now what we're going to do is we're going to set pi, or we're going to create a variable called pi, and we're going to set it to 3.142. So if I just grab my program at the moment, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to say pi equals 3.142. So this sets obviously the variable pi to obviously 3.142. Now we need to set a radius. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to say radius equals int input and then um, we're just going to ask a question, what's the radius? Now I could use a float for this as well, but I'm just going to keep it simple for now. And we're going to use um, a just standard integer. So what we're going to do is work out the area. So I'm going to put area, that's my first variable, and I'm going to do circumference. If it spells properly first. And I'm going to do diameter. So these are my three variables. So to work out the area of a circle, we need pi r squared. So that's fairly easy. So I'm going to do pi, because I've already listed what pi is, multiplied by radius. And to do the squared option in Python, what we do is a double star. So this now is pi r squared. Now if it was pi r cubed, as an example, we could do pi r uh, double star and then three but obviously it's that one there so double star two now to do the circumference circumference is two multiplied by pi multiplied by radius and the diameter is going to be two multiplied by the radius now I've done a fatal flaw there. Look, I've done the X because I'm looking and uh, looking at other things at the moment. It should be obviously the uh, multiplication here. So we have these formulas set up for us, and all we need to do now is print these out. So we need to print the answers. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do print area, and then what we're going to do is this. We're going to do area and then print circumference I always spell this one wrong I put a random comma in there and then we're going to have to do it again bear with And we're to the last one, diameter. Now, although this does look a little bit confusing, the part there that's in green obviously is going to just display, and that there is the variable that we are calling on. So let's try running this program now. So it's going to warn me just to save it. So what's the radius? Well, if I put in five as an example you can see now it has worked out the area for us now to double check what I'm gonna do is just go on to Google very quickly and if I just do five there as an example you can see it's come out near enough accurate so 78.54 78.55 so is rounded there let's do circumference of a circle and we do five again so that's 31.42, yep, fine, rounded, and we'll do diameter, just to double check. Oh, and it, uh, obviously, we can work that out without really looking at this, but it's double fives, which is 10, fantastic. So this is um, a very quick way that we can get uh, Python to work out areas for us. Now there is another option that we've got, and we can import pi, in a different way. Now I've set it as a constant variable here, but what we can do 
is we can use the math library. So if I do from math import pi, I can actually get rid of this because now when I run this program it's importing pi from the maths library. So if we run this again, I'm just going to do 5, you can see this, the answer is ever so slightly different and the reason for that is quite straightforward. If I just do this print pi, you can see that Python takes pi as that. So as I round it up, I put 3.142 Python is obviously using a few more digits there, so the, the number will be ever so slightly more accurate. So that's how you use the math library from uh, Python, and this is how you perform calculations for the radius, area, diameter, and sorry, not the radius, the area, circumference, and diameter of a circle.